normally we have a lot of car enthusiasts in our company and one day we had the idea just to have a successor of the old SLR. You know, the old predecessor was a fantastic car and we thought, okay, we should have a new version of that in order to show the world what kind of sports car Mitzel is able to build. We wanted uh, to build a real sports car, but not uh, a racer for the street. It should be uh, usable as an everyday car, a little bit like that, and uh, it should be very safe. Uh, Mercedes-Benz stands for safety and comfort, and we wanted to have that a little bit into the car too. And the other side was we want to have really a sports car with high performance, and so we combined these both parts together. Very modern car, state-of-the-art car, and this is combined with a lightweight body uh, made by carbon fiber, which is normally used in, in the Formula One, and this gives a special mix of lightweight and high technology. The uh, SLR has all the equipment you'd expect from a Mercedes-Benz. Uh, airbags, seatbelt tensioners, luxurious interior trim, satellite navigation. It is not a stripped out race car, but it's still 200 kilos lighter than an SL55 or 170 kilos lighter than a 575 Ferrari. Well, I'm going to be next. Basically, uh, what really I wanted to focus on when we're driving is just the sheer braking performance of the car. This is where you can see the real reason we've gone with the carbon ceramic brake route. The electronic brake control distributes the brakes nicely. The aerodynamics, the rear air brake really all work together to give you unbelievably short braking distances and stability. But also the balance of the car. We tried to make it as neutral as possible um, on the racetrack. So, you know, we've injected a bit of fun into what is a really an everyday car. But the overall performance on a circuit, um, I think you'll find is um, kind of hard to beat really for a, a production car. Just a moment, I'll be right with you. Actually, I'm kidding. It's easy to see why Chris is such a good long distance driver because he's extremely smooth and I hardly screamed at all. People have said to me, which bit is McLaren, which bit is Mercedes-Benz. It doesn't work like that. It was a team effort. Teams of engineers came together to create the car. And uh, it isn't just a flight of fancy either. Mercedes-Benz have done considerable research into what their customers will want in the SLR. And that is one reason why there is such a high level of equipment in the car, because that's what the customers demand. 